Hey guys, here we are at uh, the Ventura uh, EV Go Fast Charger. As you'll notice, I'm actually very, very high um, on the uh, on the uh, uh, state of charge for the car. So I'm not. I'm gonna do a DC fast charging session, but it's it's more you know partially a curiosity, partially some of the other. Um, level two chargers that were over here were taken. So I, I'm just gonna go ahead and activate it. Um, part of it is, you know, well, why not? Just to just to see what happens. The other thing is I have about 15% of my battery capacity uh, that I need to refill. And, uh, all right, let's see. I don't know why that took me there. I have about 15% of my battery capacity that I have to fill, and it will actually take a similar amount of time on fast charging versus uh, uh, a level two. Actually, it might still take a little bit longer on level two. So I figure I'll just go ahead and uh, see what happens. And also, um, I wanna see if this is a consistent behavior. Before, when I started the charge at a fairly high rate, when it should have been below 125 amps, it actually spiked up to 125 amps and stayed there for, you know, at least a few seconds at the beginning of the charge. So, all right, we're at 81%. So, it should be pretty close to uh, uh, the 25 kilowatts normally, right? So, let's let's see what happens. All right, so it didn't spike at all. So um, it looks like once you get to this point, it won't spike up above. Um, it won't spike up above that 125 amps like it was doing before. So this this drops all the way down. So and I believe the amperage here is somewhere between like 60 and 68 amps, um, and uh, maybe even just like 64. But uh, it, it's, it's significantly lower than a hundred and it looks like this one is definitely, uh, hard stopped. So even if you, even if you turn the, you know, activate a charge when it's at this state of charge, it's not going to spike above it. So, um, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and, uh, go do what I need to do while I'm here. Um, and you know, it doesn't really seem to be giving much of a, an estimate as to when it will be done. Um, just says that it will stop whenever. So, okay, well, I'm going to go do my thing and then I'll come back and hopefully everything is taken care of. Okay, so it looks like that last uh, 30 minutes, and this did shut off at 30 minutes, gave us another 8.3 kilowatt hours. So not great, but, um, you know, that slow rate that you'll see and up to 94%, which is probably high enough for what I need this for for right now. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to be done with this and, and head back, but yeah. And then this Ventura charger here, uh, the EVgo charger here, um, is still shutting off at, uh, 30 minutes. So that's another good thing to, to verify, I guess. At some point, maybe they'll update it. I'm not sure that they will. But then again, I guess it's possible that the bolt is shutting off automatically at like 94%, but I think that would be a little bit convenient given it hasn't done that for anybody else and uh, it just happened to happen exactly at 30 minutes. So yeah, up to 95%. So uh, yeah, that's uh, that's it for this installment.